Have you ever wondered what space would sound like if it had sound? It's a tantalizing question, isn't it? We often associate the vast expanse of the cosmos with an overwhelming silence. This perception isn't without reason. When we gaze up at the stars, the moon, or the distant galaxies, we're met with a profound quiet. An eternal silence that seems to echo the enormity and mystery of the universe itself. But why is space silent? Well, it has a lot to do with the way sound travels. Here on Earth sound moves in waves through the air, vibrating the tiny particles that make up our atmosphere. This movement of particles is what our ears detect as sound. But space is different, it's not completely empty, but it's pretty close. The particles are so far apart that they can't effectively vibrate and carry sound waves like they do here on Earth. So, no matter how loud the explosion of a supernova or the rumble of a collapsing star, we wouldn't hear a peep. Now this doesn't mean that space is completely quiet. In fact, if we could somehow transport our earthly atmosphere into space, we would probably hear some pretty spectacular cosmic symphonies. Imagine the deep bass rumble of a gas giant like Jupiter, or the high-pitched whine of a pulsar spinning at incredible speeds. But alas, without a medium like air to carry these sounds, the universe remains a silent movie to our human ears. But what if space could carry sound? What if the void wasn't silent at all, but filled with the roar of stars, the hum of galaxies and the whispers of comets streaking across the cosmos? This is a question that has intrigued scientists and dreamers alike for centuries. And while we may not be able to hear the universe with our ears, that doesn't mean we can't explore it through other means. Space as we understand it, is a silent void. But what if it could carry sound? Imagine a universe not defined by silence but by a cacophony of cosmic voices, each telling their own story in the grand opera of existence. To understand why space is silent we need to know how sound works. Sound, in its most basic form, is a type of energy that travels in waves, just like light or heat. These waves are produced by the vibration of an object, which causes the air around it to vibrate as well. This vibration of air molecules creates a wave that travels away from the source of the sound. Now these sound waves need a medium to travel through. This medium can be anything that molecules can vibrate in, air, water, or solid material. Here's a simple way to visualize it. Imagine dropping a stone into a calm pond. The impact creates ripples that radiate outward from the point of contact. That's similar to how sound waves spread out from a source. But what happens if there's no pond? If you drop a stone in the middle of a desert, there's no water to ripple. The stone just hits the sand and stops, this is essentially what happens with sound in space. Space is a vacuum which means it's mostly empty. Sure there are stray particles here and there but they're so far apart that they can't effectively transmit the vibration of a sound wave. So in space there's no medium for sound to travel through. Think of it like trying to have a conversation underwater. It's possible but only because water can carry sound waves. If you were to try and have that same conversation in space well, you'd be met with nothing but silence. It's not to say that there's no energy or activity in space, far from it. Stars are exploding, galaxies are colliding, and black holes are devouring matter with a voracious appetite. But all these cosmic events unfold in silence because there's no medium to carry their sounds to us. So, in the emptiness of space, sound as we know it can't exist. Yet, this silence speaks volumes about the fundamental nature of our universe. It's a constant reminder of the vast emptiness that lies between the stars and galaxies, an emptiness that's filled with intrigue, mystery, and endless possibilities for discovery. But just for a moment, imagine a universe where the rules are different. Picture this, a cosmos where the vacuum of space isn't silent but instead can carry sound. What might we hear in this alternate reality? Let's take a sonic journey through this imagined universe. First, we'd hear the roar of a rocket launch, not just at the site but reverberating through the cosmos. Imagine that thunderous sound, rumbling and echoing across the stars. It's a sound that signifies human potential, our reach for knowledge and exploration, pulsating out into the universe. Next, let's venture farther into space. Close your eyes and picture the hum of a distant star. It's not loud or intrusive, but a soft, steady drone, a constant reminder of the star's burning energy, its nuclear fusion, and the life it supports. This hum could be a comforting soundtrack to the cosmos, a lullaby sung by stars millions of light years away. Then, imagine the whisper of a comet. As it streaks across the sky, it doesn't scream or shout, but whispers. It's the sound of ice and rock hurtling through space, a hushed and fleeting sound that mirrors the comet's short-lived brilliance. Each of these sounds has its own emotional impact, 
The roar of a rocket launch inspires awe and ambition. The hum of a distant star provides comfort and constancy. The whisper of a comet offers a reminder of fleeting beauty in our vast universe. These sounds and many more would change our perception of space. It would no longer be a silent, empty void, but a vibrant, noisy cosmos, each sound telling its own story of the universe. And perhaps this noisy cosmos would make us feel less alone. The sounds would serve as constant reminders of the dynamic, ever-changing universe that surrounds us. We would be part of a cosmic orchestra, each planet, star, and galaxy contributing its own unique note. In a universe filled with sound, space would be a symphony of cosmic noise. While space may be silent, that doesn't mean we can't hear anything. When we say this, we're referring to the fact that scientists have developed ways to interpret the universe's silent whispers. But how exactly do we do that? Well, it involves a little bit of science, a little bit of technology, and a lot of curiosity. Let's dive into the realm of the unseen and unheard. The cosmos is teeming with activity that we can't detect with our human senses. But thanks to advancements in technology, we can now listen to these cosmic phenomena. You see, the universe communicates through what we call electromagnetic waves. These waves come in various forms, like radio waves, microwaves, and gamma rays, to name a few. Now, these waves aren't sounds in the conventional sense. They don't produce vibrations in the air that our ears can pick up. But they do carry information about the universe, information that we can translate into a language we understand, sound. What we do is use special instruments like radio telescopes to detect these electromagnetic waves. These telescopes act like giant antennas, picking up the waves that are emitted from celestial objects far out in the cosmos. We then use computers to convert these signals into sound. The result is a symphony of cosmic noise. Imagine tuning into the sounds of a pulsar, a rapidly spinning neutron star that emits beams of radio waves. It sounds like a steady drumbeat, the rhythm of a cosmic heartbeat. Or picture listening to the eerie, almost musical tones of a black hole, a sound that is as mysterious and fascinating as the object itself. These sounds offer us a unique perspective on the universe. They allow us to hear the stars and galaxies, to tune into the cosmic radio, and listen to the silent symphony of the cosmos. It's an experience that is as surreal as it is enlightening. Through technology we found a way to listen to the silent universe. We may not be able to hear space in the traditional sense but, that doesn't mean it's silent. It's just speaking a language that we're only now learning to understand. The space may be silent, but that silence tells a story. As we've journeyed through this celestial exploration we've uncovered the deafening silence that pervades the cosmos. This silence is not empty but rather it's filled with tales that span billions of years, woven into the fabric of the universe itself. It's a silence that invites us to listen closer, to hear the whispers of galaxies colliding, stars being born, and planets taking their first spin. The silence of space is not a void, but a canvas. On this canvas, the universe paints with light and time, creating a masterpiece that stretches across the expanse of the cosmos. Each star, each planet, each nebula, contributes a stroke to this grand portrait of existence. This vast cosmic arena is defined by its silence, but it's this very silence that makes it so awe-inspiring. It's the tranquility that allows us to marvel at the twinkling stars, the glowing galaxies and the dancing auroras. It's the quiet that amplifies the majesty of a comet streaking across the night sky, or the breathtaking sight of a planet rising over the horizon. The silence of space also sparks our curiosity and fuels our quest for knowledge. It's a silence that asks questions. How did it all begin? Are we alone? What lies beyond the cosmic horizon? The answers to these questions may lie hidden within the silence, waiting for us to uncover them. In the end the silence of space is not an absence of sound but a symphony of wonder, exploration and discovery. It's a symphony composed by the universe itself, played out on a cosmic stage for all to witness. This silent symphony is a testament to our ongoing quest to understand our place in the cosmos. It's a testament to the power of silence to inspire, to captivate, and to invoke a sense of wonder. In its silence space sings a song of endless wonder and infinite discovery.